Bobby Maximus here. Wrote a best-selling book for men's health called Maximus Body. Men's health named me one of the 100 fittest men of all time to ever walk the earth. And I fought in the UFC. And when it comes to training, a big part of my programming has always been body weight only. Why? Because there are situations in life where you don't have any equipment. Now, maybe you're on vacation. Maybe you're stuck at home. Or your gym shut down. Or maybe you're in prison. And you have nothing but a floor in your cell and you gotta figure out how to get fit. But the other reason I like body weight stuff is because it is the most functional way to train. I don't wanna be all show and no go. I want some real world horsepower and body weight will help you do that. One of my favorite body weight, I'm not even gonna say exercises, formats is the death by format. And I'm gonna walk you through exactly what that looks like. To do the death by format, all you need is a clock. And I'm gonna start the clock and I'm gonna talk and we're gonna to train together, all right? So, for the death by format, you're gonna start a clock. Here we go, it's running. In the first minute, you owe one rep. So maybe today I'm doing push-ups. So in this first calendar minute, if you will, I owe one perfect push-up, chest to ground. Full extension at the top. Now you can see the clock is still running. I don't go again until one minute has elapsed. And then in the second minute, I owe two reps of push-ups. In the third minute, I owe three reps of push-ups. In the fourth minute, I'm gonna owe four reps. In the fifth minute, I'm gonna owe five. And this workout goes until you can't do the required reps in the given time. So for push-ups, for strong people, usually that's about round 20, where you can't do 20 push-ups in a minute and you are done. And oh, the minute just went up, now I owe two push-ups. One, two, and now I get to wait till the end of this minute till I owe three. Now I just said something that you might be uh, scratching your head a little bit at. You can't do 20 push-ups in a minute. Sure, there's a lot of people that can do 20 push-ups in just one minute. That's all they had to do. But if the set before you had to do 19, and the set before you had to do 18, and the set before you had to do 17, well the wheels fall off. And so this is how the death by format works you get to whatever number you can get to. And maybe you're a beginner and you only get to the 15th round of push-ups. Maybe you're the best push-upper in the world and you get to 30, you still get a great workout. One of the things I love about this, and you can see just from this video, that the warm-up is part of the workout. And on that note, I owe three reps now because I'm in the third minute. One, two, three. But the warm-up, is part of the workout because these first sets are really easy. One push-up in minute one, two push-ups in minute two, three push-ups in minute three, four and four, it's not hard and it gives you a great chance to get warmed up. And you're watching the video and the question is, well, Bobby Maximus, can I do this with other exercises that aren't push-ups? And the answer is absolutely, all right? So I'm gonna kind of work out and talk at the same time. In about 20 seconds, I'm gonna owe four push-ups, but in between with my rest period, I'm going to give you some other exercise options. So make sure you keep watching for that. We have five seconds left and I owe four push-ups. Three, two, one, let's get it. One, two, three, four. Okay, so we're doing push-ups. What other exercises can we do? Well, you can do the simple squat. People don't squat enough. What does a squat look like? Feet are roughly shoulder width apart. Hands just under your chin or out to the front or just here. You're gonna squat down, pull parallel, and you're gonna stand back up and that counts as one. That's a great leg day movement to do by the death by workout, all right? We're gonna walk over here. We're gonna actually catalog these. Just so you have a list at the end of the video, I'm gonna get my marker. So what have we done so far? Push-ups, 
and squats. I'll make a little list for you so at the end of the video, you can take a screenshot and you can have this list for all of your exercises. And look at this, right on time, five push-ups because it's the fifth minute. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so we've talked about the push-up, talked about the squat. Now the sit-up. Underrated, an incredible exercise for developing your abs. Everyone's always looking for a new ab exercise, but the sit-up is a classic. Just have your feet bent at a 90 degree angle, lower your back to the ground, and come up. And I like to come till my chest touches my knees, and that is the sit-up. Great exercise in same kind of format, right? One the first minute, two the second minute, three the third. And one thing to note with all these different exercises, you got the push-up, you got the squat, you got the sit-up, and I'm gonna go over a bunch of other ones, different ones, uh, you'll be better or worse at them. Push-ups, pretty hard to hit 20 rounds. Squats, easy to hit 20 rounds. Sit-ups, really hard to hit 20 rounds. Burpees, which will demonstrate, forget about it. And on that note, now I owe six push-ups. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I was just talking about the burpee. Burpees, you get to 12 rounds on this, you're a savage. One burpee in one minute is no problem, right? Looks like that, chest to the ground, press up and jump. One in one minute is no problem. Two in two minutes is no problem. Three in three minutes is no problem. But with the burpee, you start getting to, let me grab down my pen, you start getting to 10 and 10, 11 and 11, 12 and 12, the wheels fall right off. So what do we got? Some sit-ups and some burpees. There's four body weight exercises, all right? Perfect again for prison. If you don't have any gear or you're on vacation or you're stuck in your home, I now owe seven push-ups because I'm in my seventh minute. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. And the reason I'm able to do this with push-ups, with burpees, it might not be like this because I might be a little out of breath, but push-ups, the first 10 minutes of this, they're relatively easy, all right? Another exercise you can do, the lunge. Just a simple reverse lunge. Another great single leg exercise, okay? What you're gonna do, you're gonna have your feet together. You're gonna stand body upright, step backwards, gently touch your knee to the ground, and then come back up so you can incorporate the lunge into the death by format. And that's a great way to build some single leg training into your programming. And single leg training is arguably the most functional thing you could do because every sport, every task you're gonna do in the real world, you're probably, it's probably some form of single leg. It's a single leg dominant activity, if you will. All right, I owe eight push-ups now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that's enough of that. You probably get the picture of how this works, but you're gonna go to whatever round you can get to. So if you're in round 20 and you owe 20 push-ups, you only get 18, workout is over. So again, for our list, one of the things I love about this format is you can do this with so many different exercises. You're not constantly doing it with push-ups. So here we go. We got push-ups. We got squats, we got sit-ups, we got burpees, we got reverse lunges. Feel free, put some leg raises in there. If you had a pull-up bar, you could do pull-ups, you could do box jumps, you could do speed skaters. I mean, really, the sky is the limit. Pick whatever exercise you want and get to work with these death by ladders. You don't need any gear. You don't need a lot of time. The perfect workout when you are stuck or like the title of the video, you are in prison.